Hello everyone, uh, I am Rajiv and today I will discuss assignment 2 for fuzzy set logic and system and application and in this assignment uh, I am validating all the answer uh, which I am going to discuss with you guys. First question, a left right membership function is defined by how many parameter? So it says straightforward question, answer is 3. There are 3 parameter through which we can define left right membership function and for uh, cross validation um, I took the uh, snapshot from the lecture material uh, you can clearly see that uh, there are three parameter alpha beta and c through which uh, it can be defined question second a pi shaped membership function is defined by how many parameter so answer is four uh, but when we are going to check the cross validation actually pi membership functions are of two type in first type there are there are only two parameter are required that is uh, pi uh, x a comma b so if we took this type of membership pi membership function then only two parameters uh, are available uh, are required uh, there are another pi membership function for which uh, four variables are or four parameters are required so because in the video uh, they took the example of uh, four um, parameter uh, through which uh, through MATLAB program they explained so uh, because statement is not so clear uh, it can be two or it can be four but uh, m from my side I took the four parameter you can uh, take your chance uh, it may be two or it may be four but uh, I preferred to go with four parameter so you can uh, check what is your call question three with the validation if s shaped membership function is defined using alpha and beta parameter then which statement is true so alpha define the feet of the membership function and uh, beta define the shoulder of the membership function so alpha define the feet and beta define the shoulder for cross validation uh, in the video it is uh, shown uh, parameter alpha define the feet of the membership function and beta define the shoulder so from that we can conclude that alpha define the feet and beta define the shoulder question 4 for a fuzzy set z defined with the universe of discourse 0 to 5 so this range is very important which of the following is a subnormal fuzzy set actually there are two type of fuzzy set normal fuzzy set and uh, subnormal fuzzy set so in normal fuzzy set actually the membership value must be equal to one but in normal subnormal fuzzy set membership value uh, should not be equal to one so from the option and it is a multi select type question first option 0, 0, 5, 1, 10, 0. so in this uh, 5 having the membership value 1 so it is a type of uh, normal fuzzy set so this uh, can be removed z is equal to 5 so no uh, option is available so this is a null set so we can conclude we can take this as a subnormal fuzzy set 2 comma 0, 0 5,0.69,100 2 having the membership value 0 that's fine 5 having the membership value 0 0.60 that's fine it is a part of subnormal uh, fuzzy set but when we look at 9,1.00 it means from we can say that it is a part of normal fuzzy set but we have to cross check that range of universe of discourse, discourse is 0 to 5 but in the option it is 9 out of the range but for that range membership value is 1 so we have to exclude this and uh, in the remaining option uh, in the range of 0 to 5 the membership value is 0 and 0.6 so we can say that uh, this is the uh, subnormal fuzzy set so out of this option option second and option third are the uh, correct one question five same question uh, with the universe of discourse right now range from 0 to 20 which of the following is a normal fuzzy set as i already 
explain to you for normal fuzzy set membership value must be equal to 1 so 0 0 0 is element having the membership value 0 5 is another element in the fuzzy set having the membership value 1 so uh, in the normal fuzzy set value must be equal to 1 so this is the uh, normal fuzzy set z is equal to null means there is no element so it is a part of subnormal fuzzy set again 2 having the membership value 0 5 having the membership value 0.6 and 15 having the membership value 1 so uh, our universe of discourse range is 0 to 20 therefore 15 lie within the range therefore it is also a normal fuzzy set so option will be correct option will be f a and c so this is the validation of question number four and five uh, from the diagram you can clearly see that fuzzy set a having the membership uh, value one so that's why a uh, is a normal fuzzy set and uh, b and c both having the membership value less than one so that's why uh, they are the uh, subnormal fuzzy set so this is the cross validation and uh, we can say our both the questions are correct Question number 6, 7, 8, 9 and 10, uh, these are depend uh, based upon alpha cut and strong alpha cut. So very very simple question, uh, 6 to 10, just we have to analyze this property. For alpha cut, uh, there is a specific fuzzy set, that is A is a fuzzy set uh, with the alpha cut, so small x belongs to a universe of discourse capital X and uh, AX. Uh, value must be greater than alpha so alpha we have to define alpha 0 0.1 0 0.3 0 0.5 as per the question and so this must be equal to greater than equal to alpha but in strong alpha uh, you can uh, see that ax greater than alpha but in alpha cut ax greater than equal to alpha so the basic difference is that in strong alpha ax must be greater than alpha but in normal alpha cut ax greater than and equal to alpha so with the help of these two equation we can solve rest of the question that is question number six seven eight nine and ten question number six for a fuzzy set z with the universe of discourse zero to ten this is the range of our universe of discourse is defined below what will be the alpha cut set for z alpha 0.3 so it is a normal alpha cut not the strong one so for alpha 0.3 so it mean uh, in which membership value is 0.3 we have to consider that particular element also if you see the question 0 1 2 and it is up to 10 so 0.3 it means uh, alpha cut 0.3 it is a normal alpha cut so we have to consider three element uh, element number three which is a, a having the membership value 0.3 and more than this 0 0.4 0 0.5 0 0.6 so 3 to 10 so these are the uh, fuzzy set with the having the uh, alpha cut value greater than equal to 0.3 so from the option you can see that 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 10 so this one is the correct option because in normal alpha cut you have to consider the that threshold value also uh, which is mentioned so in this case threshold value is 0.3 so we have to consider 0.3 membership value element is 3 so 3 onward up to 10 are the part of the fuzzy set same question but uh, in this case strong alpha cut is given so in the strong alpha cut we have to neglect 0.3 membership element so in this case uh, 3 comma 0.3 that is 3 is a element of fuzzy set having the membership value 0.3 but it is a part of strong alpha cut that we then in this case we have to exclude 3 therefore answer will be 4 5 6 7 8 9 10 so correct option is 4 2 10 this one is the correct one because it is a strong alpha cut so threshold value 0.3 so we have to exclude that particular element of the fuzzy set so from 4 to 10 are the part of the fuzzy set question 8 for a fuzzy set z with the uh, universe of discourse 0 to 10 defined below what will be the strong alpha cut uh, 
set for z equal to alpha phi so that is the same question in this case uh, alpha value is equal to 0.5 but is a question of strong alpha cut so uh, from this option we can say that we have to drop this one because uh, alpha equal to 0.5 so 6 7 8 9 10 so we have to select all these option because in this case in this case strong alpha value is 0.5 so 0.5 case of strong alpha cut that's why we have to uh, neglect this one so correct option is 6 to 10 so option is c question 9 for a fuzzy set z with the universe of discourse 0 to 10 defined below what will be the alpha cut alpha cut so normal alpha cut value is equal to 0.7 so we have to consider that particular element in which a membership value is 0.7 so here membership value 0 0.1, 0 0.2, 0 0.3, 0 0.4, 0 0.5, 0 0.6. So all from all these we have to exclude. So normal cut, it means membership value we can consider from 0.7 to 1. So the correct option is 7, 8, 9, 10. 7, 8, 9, 10. So this is the correct option. Question 10. For a fuzzy set Z with the universe of discourse 0 to 10, what will be the intersection of alpha cut and strong alpha cut and strong alpha cut for alpha 0.7 in this case alpha is equal to 0.7 for normal alpha cut uh, the element will be equal to 7 to 1 that is 7 8 9 10 but in case of strong alpha cut we have to exclude 0.7 so in this case uh, in case of strong alpha cut uh, element will be 8 9 10 8 9 10 but in normal 7 8 9 10 7 8 9 10 normal alpha cut but in the case of strong alpha cut value will be equal to 8 9 10 8 9 10 and after that we have to uh, took the intersection which are common to both so it is uh, clearly that uh, we can see that 8 9 10 are common from both these elements 8 9 10 so intersection of alpha cut and strong alpha cut will be equal to 8 9 10 so option b is correct option so thank you so much and uh, if there is any discrepancy in the solution uh, you can let me know um, so that we can correct um, but uh, from my side uh, i am trying my best so that uh, accuracy will be 100 percent and uh, thank you so much and uh, next assignment solution will be uploaded uh, one week prior to the submission date. Thank you.